Warm greetings to everyone. I would like to share the memoir that I have written and released. The book is called Malarum Ninaivugal. I wrote this book only to make good use of the ample spare time I had at my disposal ever since the start of the corona pandemic. I have been recollecting a lot of cherished memories and experiences that I have penned down in the book to share with all the devotees. In this book I have spoken about my marriage at the age of 20, my years of family life, the 60th wedding anniversary and the experiences and memories around the celebrations. I have shared my feelings during these moments, the progress and development of our family over the years. I have also written about the recent 80th wedding anniversary celebrations which all of you might have witnessed. Experiencing three weddings in a person's life is quite a rare blessing. Mother Adi Parasakti has graced us. I have shared how we have utilized this opportunity given to us. I have attempted to examine and compare the emotions of a young girl married off at 20 with that of a woman during her 60th or 80th wedding surrounded by grandchildren. I hope you will enjoy reading this. In this journey of life in a marriage with children and grandchildren i look back and i feel satisfied and complete i pray to the divine mother to bless you all with the same happiness and fulfillment om shakti om sakti leading a life of mutual love and virtue is key arul tiru amma and tirumati amma have not just led righteous and noble lives but have been pioneers in enabling a million devotees towards leading a life of service and charity this was much appreciated during arul tiru adigalar's 79th birthday celebrations by a judge who acknowledged the achievements and social contributions made by adigalar and remarked that it was incomparable In an oracle the divine mother once said that the fact that amma being both a householder and a monk is the most distinguished aspect of this spiritual movement and householders should jointly participate in performing spiritual services at a time when people regarded spirituality and marriage as being poles apart the movement has shown the world that it is possible for one to be spiritual and still perform duties as a householder arul tiru amma and tirumadi amma have been demonstrating this in the most remarkable way it is also tirumadi amma's selfless service cooperation contribution compassion and the desire for everyone's well-being that we have been able to receive amma's grace today We see many women and men participate in spiritual activities amidst a lot of conflict and opposition in the family. Right from the inception of this movement, Amma's focus has only been on worship methods, spiritual conferences, yagams, new moon, full moon prayers, festivals, and charity for the welfare of all the people. Amma has also personally addressed every individual's problems through oracles and pada puja. All this while Tirumati Amma has not only attended to her family but has also taken up a lot of initiatives and activities to serve with utmost dedication. Today on this occasion of the 52nd wedding anniversary of Arul Tiru Amma and Tirumati Amma we hereby witness and celebrate the joy that true spirituality brings to married life. Just as a giant banyan tree grows to offer shelter to many So too does this blessed marriage stand as a spiritual shelter to millions to lead a family life and yet be detached is no ordinary feat spiritual guru adigalar for the last 50 years has been a guiding force to his family as well as to millions of red clad devotees and followers it is for this reason that the divine mother adi parashakti in one of her oracles has said that the mother holds special affection and respect for adigalar something that no other guru has ever received om sakti